Good evening, everyone. My name is Heath Haskins, Code Primate, and welcome back to Wood Mill Incorporated. Yes, I said it right. Uh, before I get started, like always, be sure to like, comment, subscribe down below. Oh, and notification bell. So, it's your choice. If you want to, go for it. If not, that's cool too. I'm going to play anyway. Look what I got! <laughs> I don't know if I showed, did I show this to you guys yet? Did, did I show you the awesomeness that is the Code Primate poster? Oh wait, why can I not open it? No, I can't open it. <gasps> no, it's broken. No, what about Cam? <gasps> Cam's works. Why didn't mine work? I don't understand. All right, so hold on. We're just gonna rotate that and do a turn. Uh, rotate, uh, rotate, not turn, uh, rotate again. Come on, why, why is it not? <laughs> Maybe another rotate, like that. And just there like that. Boom, look at that. Look at that architecture work. Who built that amazing artness? I have no clue, I don't know who that was. Who could have done such an awesome job? <laughs> Anyhow, um, I think we are going to come up with some kind of like standard for uh, YouTubers who want to have their poster inside the game. Um, if you are a YouTuber and you record, um, there is a specific like size that you have to have. And I had it like posted somewhere, but we'll come up with something. And you know, there's an idea that we have to have a specific store for. Uh, YouTuber posters and stuff like that that you could purchase like the the posters of the youtubers that play in the game and stuff like that And put them on your wall and show your support for them be like hey, it's cool primate mm -hmm. or whoever you know just But why does that not work? I'm I'm royally upset. That's That makes me sad anyhow um, I thought what we would do today is come inside and see some of the updates that they've got going on uh, that the devs have got going on and I understand that I'm one of the devs as well But I want you guys to understand. I don't want to be in charge of the programming. So Don't send what is going on with that tree? That's not oak tree is it? Is that an oak tree? Why did it split like that? Hold up. Oh I don't have an axe on me. Why don't I have an axe on me? No code why? Why? Do I need to open up an alpha? I can't remember. Did I leave an axe on my base? I got the basic right there. That's that's the small one. I don't I don't want that one. I want this one. Give me that one. Yes. Yes, gloriousness. And um I messed up on the um Ooh, it looks like they built more into the mountain. Let's go to the mountains. Um, they built more onto the um, shop, onto the car shop. So there's an, a now a, a bigger car to go and get. So I will have to go and do that. But as far as um, daytime, nighttime stuff, it's uh, rotating now. So the sun actually moves, which is good. Because now there's a daytime, nighttime cycle. Ooh, what is that song? I like it. I like it a lot. It's very medieval sounding. Wait, why are there oak trees and not... Okay, okay, there we go. <laughs> Choppy chop time. Come with me if you want to plank. Should I, should I head up there first and see what all new stuff they have? Probably, but, whoa, hello. <coughs> okay, we'll, we'll come back for this tree. It looks like there's more been built. What more could you have awesomely put up here, guys? Maybe I'm wrong? Just so you know, the developers have been working round the clock, and I'm like, guys, you can take a break and you can chill for a second if you if you want to, because 
There's been a lot of development. Look at this. Oh, it's a birch tree area. Mm, wait a second. What's that over there? Is there a backside to the volcano? Oh gosh. Oh, does it just drop straight off? Oh man. See, and this is what you get with uh, pre-alpha, pre-release. Hold on. Is this a shadowy area or is this like an entrance? In fact, I think it's just a shadowy area. By the way, this place is massive. Or maybe my car just slow. Is it, is it my car? Uh, anyhow, what I kind of want to do, I want to, I want to build up enough money to go and buy the second car, but I don't, I don't even know how much it costs. Is the, is the song too loud? Oh, my sound's down. It should be fine. We're fine. Whew. One thing that you could do with the uh, the cars and lumber is you could let go, and it would go faster downhill. And that's because it had uh, wheels. It had hinge wheels. So. It's one thing you can't do in these cars. Which I'm okay with. Because have you ever had your car on the side of a mountain and like you're trying to put stuff in the back and it starts rolling downhill? Like, dang it, where's the parking brake? All right, back it up. There we go. Come with me. Come with me. Sit, sit, sit down. Dang it. Why is this not working? Okay, you know what? Let's do this. Alley oop, up, up, up. And come on. There we go. There we go. That'll be good. That'll be good. I should be able to hold it from there. As long as it's touching part of your car, you can kind of wedge it in there and drive backwards and hold the whole thing. You can do that with big trees too. As long as the weight is not heavy, so heavy that it stops the car from moving, this is totally acceptable so far. <sighs> What's a pop pocket? How you doing, buddy? Now don't I need to go down the hill or am I? I'm over here on the top of the hill, aren't I? Okay, hold on. Oh, oh, not there, not there. Come on, back it up. Ah, dang it, where's my, where's my base? There it is, that's my base down there. Come on, come on, grab, grab. There we go, oh. <laughs> just run it with the front of the car. That's fine. What is that? Is that just Oakwood? All right, we can, we can go sell that off too. That's cool. Boom. Now, I think they've got the bigger sawmills in the store. Oh, no. Stop. Stop. Hi, buddy. Whoa. Hi. Tag. Hi. <laughs> Hi. Lots of people are chatting. Hi. I don't think I'm going to be able to get that in there. Hold on. <clears throat> now, if I remember right, they were working on a way to stop me from... Uh, putting the wood in through the top of the mill. So let's see if let's see if they did it. Let's see if they fixed my glitch. Oh nope, they didn't do it. <laughs> Bye. Bye. Oh he says be right back. Why is it not chopping? Choppy chop. There you go. Now, I know a lot of you, a lot of you have been... <sighs> Pre
free candy. What did you just do? <laughs> okay. <laughs> so if you're standing on a log, you can you can glitch the cart to take you even faster. Who would have thought of something like that? That's awesome. Okay. I I love it when stuff like that is uh figured out and known. Come on. Come on. <sighs> oh, come on. Why is that not? B. There we go. Thank you, Cam, for uh, telling me about that, because you, you were telling me that you were just trying to grab the, the wood as fast as possible on the move. Which totally works. I like it. I like it a lot. Okay. So let's move. Move the structure. Get really close. And down you go. There it goes. Wait. Did it go in? I don't think it went in. Did it? <gasps> no, did I fill in a blueprint right there? I did, didn't I? Okay. Dang it. All right. These should be able to go in just by themselves, right? Yeah, there they go. Good deal. All right. We will stack these up crossways like this because it's always easier to stack these crossways like this. <clears throat> I don't know why it's easier to stack them like this. And somebody was asking for a flatbed truck. I think that's a brilliant idea. I love that. But how big is it going to be? You know? What is the max that... <sighs> okay. Wood is a bit glitchy, isn't it? Oh, oh, stay, stay. Dang it! <laughs> it's a glitchy wood. I think there'd be a little bit more stability with it being so big. Okay. There's also uh, ideas for Putting, being able to sell your wood from your plot. And I thought, that's a horrible idea. That like defeats one of the purposes of selling off the wood at the wood store, you know? But what if you were to, hi buddy, want this? Sure, yeah, I'll take that, thank you. What if you were to buy a drop-off zone? Right, and what you could do is you could fill up that drop off zone with different particular kinds of wood, say, like this little stack right here, right? And it would sit on that drop off zone once it was full, or once you wanted it to be sold, you could call a guy that would come out of the wood store shop, drive over to your base to that particular spot, pick it up and all in the back of his car, and then it would drive it back over and sell it off but only at half cost, so you'd like a delivery fee, you know? It's a thought, it's an idea. Be a lot of animation. But, could call it Code's Delivery Service. Half your profits, all cash. No cash on delivery. Oh, oh, oh. No CODs. Voidware prohibited. <clears throat> How much did I get for that? 900. Not bad. Not too bad. I like that this guy's just still driving around on his cart. That's awesome. Hello. I got a message. Boom, 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 boom. Oh, thank you. Here, can I? I 
can't grab it. I can't grab it. No. Oh, maybe. That's for you. Thank you. I'm trying to get it to go in. It's just not, not happening. There we go. Okay, pull it out for a second. Hold on. Hold on. Oh, oh, oh. Hold on. Set it up here on top like this. And we're gonna we're gonna push these to the max limit that it can go, which is two by one by ones. All right, should be able to move. There it goes. Good deal. Now, will this go in? That's the question, because it's got like those three little pieces right there. Thank you, by the way. Thank you for dropping this off for me, Hot Pocket. I appreciate it. All right, drop this down here. Move structure. I could just buy a bigger thing, bigger sawmill, just saying. Is that too many units? Too many units? Do we have max units here? Max unity? I think so. Hi! How are you? Mr. Fried? Or Mr. Fred? Oh gosh. Um, can I chop it right here? Yeah, that'll work. Okay. Let's pull this out right here. And drop it down right there. Move structure. Down you go. Come on. Come on. No, don't drop. Dang it. Can I get a screenshot? Sure, absolutely. Jeez. Oh, hold on. You want to face this way or this way? Here, face that direction. Face this way. There you go. Jeez. Got it. Yay. I got it. Oh my gosh, long plank. <laughs> okay, let's keep going. Will that go in? Yeah, that'll go in. Nice. Okay, I think this just might still be too large. Move structure over here. Boom. Hi, Pop-Tart. He's got a uh, Code Primate t-shirt on. structure. There it goes. That's what we were looking for. Okay, last one. Last one. Excuse me. Oh, did you want a screenshot? Jeez. Oh, poof. <laughs> Feathers. <laughs> screenshot. There you go, buddy. <laughs> you are most welcome. here and move and down yes that's beautiful sorry to bother you sorry sorry to bother you but may I have one as well yes you may <laughs> jeez there you go buddy oh it wasn't a code primate t-shirt it was a it's another youtuber though thank you you're welcome and if you can convince that YouTuber to make a video about about uh, the game, I might be able to convince the developers to put them into uh, a poster. Just saying. Is this mine? This is definitely mine, isn't it? That is a crazy long plank. <laughs> I like it. I like it a lot. Okay. Let's go here. Go here. Come on. Just fit in there, please. can't believe that all fit. That's crazy. Oh, 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 it didn't fit. It didn't fit. I lied. I lied. It's not fitting. Oh, <laughs> thank you. Thank you, Pop-Tart. No, uh, Hot Pocket. <sighs> all these food names, I'm getting hungry. 
Uh, oh, by the way, by the time you see this video, I'm going to be back on keto. I took the weekend off so I could have chocolate chip cookie dough. And I was really happy about it too. So, um, for any parents out there, uh, anybody who's diabetic or maybe um, larger children who are looking for um, a nice easy diet, have you ever tried keto? It's actually a, it's a lifestyle is what it is. And it works, it works wonders. I feel better on keto. And basically, if you don't know what keto is, it's, it's cutting out all carbs and all sugars. So you eat pure meat and, and fat and oils. So like bacon and eggs, absolutely. You can eat a ton of that. Cheese, you can have tons of cheese, different, different kinds of cheese. Um, oils, especially olive oil. Oh, olive oil is the best. But are, are you helping me? Are these for me? <laughs> it's for me. <laughs> Is that meme dead yet? Can can we please pass on that meme? Um, I'm done with it. Will this go backwards? It doesn't go backwards. It doesn't go backwards. Of course, I don't. I don't think it's gonna go forwards either. Oh, it did. Sweet. There's one. Oh man, it feels good just to build again, to to lumber. Sorry, to wood mill. It feels good to be in a public server again. Uh, for those of you who are wondering, and the question has been asked a lot, yes, the game will be free. You don't have to pay the 800. The only reason people are paying the 800 is because they wanted to play it before the game is developed, before the game is released. So, if you can wait, if you can hold off, I mean, there you can absolutely can. Um, is there going to be a special uh, item, a special recognition for people who uh, help support the pre-alpha? Yes, there will be. Do I know what it is? No, I do not. I have not discussed, and, and I'm not the decision maker. I want to be the player of this game. I don't want to be in charge of it, you know? That's, that's the biggest difference, is I will have absolute creativity influences and the ability to create things inside the game itself, but do I want the, the full responsibility of being the person that's in charge of it? Oh, dude, look what it's doing! Oh, do you know what that was doing? That piece of wood was generating, but it couldn't move forward, so it was pushing back. And it was touching the generator again. So it just generate, just generate, just generate. Oh my gosh. We may have just found like one of the coolest bugs in the game right there. Who knows? Or not. It, it could be lame and I'm just dumb. But who knows? Is that your car? Or is, that's your car. Because that one's got twosies. Two seater. Uh, also, to the person that asked if we could have multiple cars with, um, like a like a crew cab, that's a great idea. Like a four-person seater car, I would love that. Or maybe even like a bus, take everybody on a camping trip. You know, Code Primate Tours, starting today at twelve thirty. Bring your luggage, leave your mind at home. Have you guys noticed that this wood just flings like crazy? Like all the time? Come on, sit, sit. I'll be back. Get my little wings out like a little airplane. <clears throat> Sorry, I've not kept up on my coffee today. Hold on, adjust that a little bit. Wee. Here we go. Wait, was that a piece of my wood? I think that was a piece of my wood. It was a piece of my wood. Holy cow. All right, can I pick you up? Put you in the back? That didn't work. Try again. Pick 
you up. Put it in the back. There you go. What? Just get in there, dude. There we go. Thank you, everyone, for, for helping me out on the, uh, on the wood down there. It's awesome. We're at 25 minutes. Oh my gosh. I did not realize it was going to be going that fast. Oh my gosh. Yay. <laughs> All right. A little bit more. Uh oh. It's just the right size to get stuck. That's not good. There's two, three, four. known as WMI. Keep it tuned in right here for all your code primate sounds. Coming directly to you from Roblox. Oh yeah. <laughs> Sorry, we may have to change that song. <laughs> Especially after code. Code, what are you doing? <laughs> oh man. Okay, I'm tired. I just, uh, I, I had a very long Sunday and um, just... I'm ready to play because I know all the progress here. It's it's going to get wiped, which is sad to me, but at the same time, understandable. I know the work that's going into this. So show your support to the developers. Uh, join their Discord and send off a message to them and say, thank you guys for doing this and thank you for all your hard work because if nobody else, I myself, I'm going to say it to you guys directly. Thank you. I know how much has gone into this and I know how hard you're working on it. I couldn't imagine having that much dedication into a game. Like I've made games before, I've made games in the past and I've made multiple like environments, experiences, whatever you want to call them. They're hard. I know I, I wrote a book on programming. Hey, is that Bunny? <gasps> That's not Bunny Films. You silly goose. Okay, let's go see if the advanced car, how much is the advanced car? I think it's like six, <coughs> excuse me, 6,000. Whoa, whoa. Of course they have the advanced sawmills and stuff now too. <clears throat> I like the coloring of the bridge. That was kind of cool. Toll. We're gonna have toll bridges. The toll. The toll. The toll. The toll. The toll. Oh, is it open? Oh, it looks like it's open. Yay! Hello, dummy. Look at that two seater. Nice. Oh my guts. Did you guys hear that? I'm hungry. Hungry again. Are you sure you want to purchase a two seater for 800? It's only 800? Yes. Hope you're satisfied with your purchase. I am. Thank you, dummy. I appreciate your, your time. Oh my goodness. Yay. Okay. I don't appreciate that. That was poopy. There we go. Yay. So the two-seater should be a little bit bigger, should have a little bit more room in the back to to carry our logs and our wood. And we are going to have attachments of some kind, some kind of trailer hitch. Maybe make it a little bit more advanced, like you actually have to set it down on things and like crank it up and like back into it, crank it back down. Maybe a winch on the front of the car so we can flip ourselves back right. <laughs> Who knows? 
Who's this? Hello. I'm gonna read their sign real quick. Sold to Sleepy Ducko. Oh, Sleepy Ducko. Why are you sleepy? Okay. Almost there. Almost there. And nice. Let's see what kind of lottery we get for the car here. Alright, ready? Oh. Nice. Got an orange car. And that is a little bit bigger on the base. On the back side. I like it. That's it for this episode. Thank you everyone for watching this episode of Wind, Wind, Windmill. Of Windmill Incorporated. No, of Woodmill Incorporated with me, Heath Haskins, Code Primate. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe down below. Do all those cool things that's supposed to call out at the end of the videos like a good YouTuber does. But it's your choice. If you want to, go for it. If not, that's cool too. You were here, you watched, you had fun. I love you for that. Have a great day. We'll talk to you soon. <sighs> Outro. Want some new merch? Check out teespring.com. Outro.